So today we're gonna depart from GeoGuessr, we're gonna depart from Weird News Adventures, and we're gonna head straight into Small Town America? I, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with this. Um, I recently laughed as I remembered a chance discovery. That was a town. Now what happened was is I ordered some clothing online and when it shipped, the vendor sent me a shipped email and in it it included an image of a map of like the warehouse where it currently was residing and I couldn't help but laugh. It was in Kentucky, outside of Louisville, so let's head on over there. It was being sent from somewhere around this area, right on the border with Indiana, and I noticed Pleasure Ridge Park, which, you know, the 10-year-old boy inside of me, I guess, found that utterly hilarious. So I thought that was a funny name, and so I looked it up just to see what it was like. I was just browsing around, as you do on Google Maps, and um, a, a nearby town took even more precedence over Pleasure Ridge Park, which was this one right here. I couldn't help but laugh my ass off and text everybody I knew about Penile, Kentucky. Apparently they don't call it Penile because who wants to say they live in Penile? They call themselves or call their hometown Panile. I really think that's wishful thinking. There's no way that this is Panile. It's fucking penile. You have to get real with it. Now there are some funny things in penile, sorry, Panile, that I think you'll enjoy. The first thing is uh, Larry's auto body, which, you know, that's pretty common. Gary's auto body, Larry's auto body. These are very typical names for an auto body shop. However, I really enjoy that it's right at the crossroads of Penile Road and Manslick Road. I'm a 10 year old boy inside, what can I say? I find that utterly hilarious. Then another thing I, I really like is somebody's been having a laugh because if you go a little further down, oh hell, where'd it go? <gasps> Did they take it down? No. Oh, I think it's gone. I'll have to put a screenshot here. Um, somebody named their house Balls Deep in the Bullshit, and it was it was right around here, but I don't see it anymore, and that's really disappointing. Uh, anyway, that was there. Um, another favorite feature of Penal Oh no, Perry Village. We've gone too far. That sounds far too wholesome. Oh, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to drive around for a while trying to find this. Hmm. Where is it? Oh, Beelick Creek. As if the theme doesn't continue. Why would you call it Beelick? Creek. What could have possibly happened here to call it Beelick Creek? Anyway, let us continue. Changing the spelling won't make your church any better off being located in or near Panile. Uh, there was another great crossroads around here somewhere. It was Penile Road and there it is. I mean, can you imagine trying to meet a friend and being like, hey, um, I'll meet you at the intersection of Penile and Cummings. Has anybody ever said that? Non-ironically. <laughs> Generally really like that everywhere seems to avoid naming themselves, you know, Penile. This should be the Grace Fellowship of Penile, but they've gone for the greater, you know. It ain't, it ain't Grace Fellowship of, of Louisville. It's Grace Fellowship of Penile, um, and it ain't Penile either, for that matter. I mean, why Manslick? You could even kind of make a stretch on, on old new cut. You know what, can we find out more about it? To be honest, does it have a Wikipedia page, this town? It might. Oh, it does. Oh, it does. It has a Wikipedia page. Oh my god, it's so unfinished. What a disappointment. Penile, Penile, is a historic, oh, it's historic community located in Jefferson County, Kentucky. Formerly an unincorporated community, it was designated neighborhood of Louisville. The city merged with Jefferson County in 2003. <sighs> Penile is pronounced by locals as Penile. Further explanation needed. No, I really don't think there's further explanation needed at all. Most prominent sites in Penile are a cemetery. Oh yes, that's very rare. Not everywhere has a cemetery. And yeah, it's 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 not Penile. They can tell themselves that all they want. It's just not. Paintball asylum where everybody goes to recover from having to live in a town called Penile. I really want to meet somebody who lives here. You know what, let's check the satellite view. What's it like? Oh, how idyllic. Very idyllic. Oh my God, it's right by South Park. No way. Larry's auto body in Penile is right by South Park. I mean, it's just made for jokes. Made for jokes. You know, there's a lot of churches. I suppose it is Kentucky. Where's Penile Baptist Church? Penile, Bap, oh my God, Baptist. 
church. Oh, that's a lot. You know, I think they changed their name. Gotta update the Wikipedia page. It doesn't exist. Oh, maybe it's the one they misspelled intentionally. It must be this one. They changed the bloody name. Oh my God. Even in the Google reviews. Loving people, great music, and it's pronounced Penile. Oh, is it now? Yes, Penile. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah. I've never been there, but I thought it was penile instead of peniel, so I'm mad. Penile, sorry, penile. Gotta get my uh, stress right there. I need to see more reviews of this church. That's it, two stars, no reason given. Oh my God, and there's a bar nearby called Man Lords. It's amazing. It is just an extraordinarily astonishing joy. What else is here? There's a random clothing store in a bush, gunsmithing. It is Kentucky. I just feel like if you're gonna have a name like, we're gonna call it penal i'm sorry also how many jokes do these kids make about going to pleasure ridge park high school you know they make so many i would i would make it all the time everybody at that high school fucks just saying might have to cut that out once upon a child that sounds creepy so i imagined when we were in map view and there are all these creeks and rivers i thought they would be more visible but they don't appear to exist in satellite view <laughs> Like, that's really a creek? That's not a creek, that looks like a running path. Oh, the creek's in the bush. Oh, I see it now. Okay, fair enough. All right, I'll give them, I'll give them the wholesome pond creek. God, that's original. Who named these places? Is there, do they have like a, a town website? I really hope they do. Welcome to Penile. What comes up for images actually? Oh yeah, it's not just me. Cummings and Penile. I mean, you want to visit just for that. And there you go. This man has been very, very happy to find Penile Baptist Church. And Manslick and Penile. I mean, what? I should get a shirt with this on there. <laughs> I mean, you can't make this shit up. Unusual Kentucky, no kidding. Here's somebody's blog, who is this? I don't know who this is, I don't endorse them, but I also endorse this blog post. Long have I been intrigued by a tiny Jefferson County town listed only on the most detailed Kentucky maps known as Penal. Penile. Why on earth is there a town called Penile? No one seems to know. As if it's not bad enough or hilarious enough, depending on your point of view, to have a town whose name begs for poor old jokes. Two intersections in the area who have equally unfortunate names. The corner of Penile and Cummings is one, and then there's the corner of Penile and Man's Lake. I swear I'm not making this up. I, I trust me, I, I believe you. Oh, somebody attended a wedding there. Wildly conservative Baptist church. I thought the name or two until I remember another small church located in PRP at the corner of Greenwood Road and Greenbelt Highway called Pen- Oh, that's so it didn't rename itself. Mm. Apparently the word penile refers to a place where Jacob of Genesis fame and not the band wrestled with an angel or literally the face of God. Really? Oh. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Pneal, pneal. Okay, so why'd they make it into Penile? So it's my guess the town of Penile was perhaps supposed to be named Penile, but some intrepid took in Kentucky soul couldn't spell where the good shit is probably to blame. I was just about to say it was just one of those cases where you take a word from something and just say it sounds like Penile and make it into Penile. I too live near Penile. I would like to add that Penile goes through Beaver Run and ends up in Knob Creek. <laughs> Oh my god. Gold. Solid gold. Wait, does it really? Hang on. Go back to go back to bloody maps. Knob Creek. Was there seriously a knob creek? Blue lick. What's with all the licks? It's getting a bit weird. Fishpool Creek, that's original. Well, I don't know where Beaver Run and Knob Creek are, but I'm sure they are very, very fine places. Oh, real estate. Oh, let's check the Airbnbs. Alright, let's check. Let's see what's available here. Oh, let's uh, zoom in here. We want proper peanut. Okay, let's see. What can you get for 124k? Not bad. Let's uh, throw some big bucks. 146. Oh, they put it as Louisville. No, it should be penile. I wouldn't want to live there unless I get penile on my ID. Oh, half a mil. What is that? That's quite expensive. Hmm, they have a gate. Hidden gem in Windsor Forest. Penile. Penile, you live in penile. I love it. It's just gorgeous. It is just a fabulous Oh, there's Knob Creek! Knob Creek Road! Oh my god, it's real. Not that I doubted it for a second, but you know. Okay, now I have to find Beaver- Oh, there's Knob Creek! Where's Beaver Run? Oh, I'm never gonna find it. Ah, oh, it's so disappointing. Vacation. <laughs> Top <Don't> print. <pretend. laughs> 
Every time I read it in a sentence, I can't help but laugh like a child. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. If if you're one of the ten people that see my channel, you know you don't come here for intellectual content. You know we skip right past it. So I guess this shouldn't be that big of a surprise. Nobody sells it as penile. Do you know how much they could improve tourism if they just absolutely owned the fact that it's penile, not penile, it's penile. They just have to own it. Everybody will go there. Where was this man? Where was this man? He was so happy. Look how happy this man is. This man was so happy to have found penile. There could be more like him. There could be so much money flowing through penile. I mean, real big dick energy, what can I say? Oh, there is a t-shirt. I need it. I really need it. The sexiest places in Kentucky. Yeah, there's definitely one of them. Ooh, that looks grim. Don't know that penile Kentucky is going to be known for its tacos. Anyway, um, so that's our little small town adventure through Penile. Don't say it. Don't say it. Penile. It's penile. I'm sorry. They should own it. They should rock it. They should enjoy it. They should, s well, maybe not put up big signs because I know I'd steal it. Um, if I had the opportunity. Oh, I'm sorry, as of- I was about to sign off, but as I've just noticed, Scott's secret fishing spot is on Google Maps. Can't possibly be that secret. That's not keeping it a secret. Anyway, this has been an adventure in small town America. Uh, slash, this wasn't really a small town, to be honest, because it's sort of- they're trying to blend into Louisville, but we all know it's a small town called Peanut. Anyway, um, if you enjoyed this tiny small town adventure, I had a lot of fun doing this. I learned some things I had not learned before about, uh, Penal. We'll just keep quiet. It's not Penile. It's not. They're kidding themselves. Honestly, they. Ugh. Okay, the sign off is getting too long. If you enjoyed this little small town adventure in Penile, please drop a like. Please consider subscribing. I do all kinds of weird stuff here if you're new. Um, we enjoy looking through the news for some fun stuff and playing GeoGuessr and just generally doing silly, fun things. So do subscribe if you're interested in more. And uh, yeah, see ya. <laughs>